Come here, let me tell you a secret. Canva is one of the best places to get started with your t-shirt designs. Listen, if you're not really good at graphic design or you don't wanna pay somebody uh, a lot of money to create your t-shirts, Canva is a really, really good place to get started because they have a lot of amazing templates, okay? And so in this video, I'm gonna show you how I walk through creating designs for my own brand uh, with Canva and hopefully it will help you out as well. So no matter if you're trying to source your own clothing or if you're you're trying to do print on demand canva can help you out so if you're excited go ahead and thumbs up the video i would greatly appreciate it just helps with the youtube algorithm to let other people know about my content and as well i do want to let you guys know that i am offering one-on-one -on -one youtube master classes so if you are interested in creating content on youtube how to turn your youtube channel into a full-on business definitely sign up it is limited spacing uh so definitely sign up asap but without further ado let's Let's get into the video. Now, before you load up the Canva, you will need Canva Pro because with Canva Pro, it allows you to get that transparent background that you need because you need a transparent PNG file, okay? And so what I did, I teamed up with Canva to make sure that you guys got a free 30-day trial. So if you want that free 30-day trial, go ahead and hit the link in the description below and I'll link it as the first comment. But again, you will need Canva Pro to get that transparent background so you can upload it to your Teespring, your Printful, Printify, stuff like that. Or if you just wanna outsource to somebody. So make sure that you hit the link in the description if you want that free 30 day trial. All right, you guys, now that you have your Canva pulled up, it's relatively simple to get to the design. So all you have to do is go to the search bar here, type in t-shirt, and look, it's already suggested for me. So type t-shirt in, then it'll load up, and then you see all these t-shirt designs that you can use, switch up, um, and I'm gonna try to see what t-shirt design that I wanna create. Cause there's so many you guys like there's so many t-shirts that you can create on here let me see here let me see if i find something that i like okay here boom protagonist all right so let's just say you take this so my brand is called movements over barriers so I would type in movements over barriers. Uh, I don't really like that. I don't like how fat and chunky the box is. Can I? Okay, make it smaller. Actually, actually, instead of doing that, I've been really on this like fearless kick. That's been one of like my favorite sayings so far. So let's make the box a little smaller. You know, stop living in fear. Fearless, right? And I like that. Fearless, center it a little bit. That's not bad. Bebis Neo. That's one of the most popular ones. So like for fonts, Bebis Neos, I guess that's how you say it, is, is a very popular font. So if you need wording, definitely use that. Um, let me see. See if I bold it, how it looks. Bolded. That's not bad, it's simple, right? Nothing too crazy. Again, this is a tutorial, so I don't wanna take up too much of your time. Right, so I could do that. I wonder if I could make the actual lettering bigger without making the box bigger too much. Okay, nah. So that's about as big of lettering I can get without making 
the box any bigger, okay? So, very simple design that you can use for your t-shirt. So let's just say, boom, I like this. How can I get the PNG file? So all you have to do is go up to here, go up to downloads. And then what you're gonna wanna do, you wanna times it by two, okay? Cause you want a good quality file because when you upload it to Printful um, or Printify or whatever your print on demand company is, you wanna make sure that you get a transparent background and a good size quality. So I always go up to two um, and then I do transparent background and then I hit download. Super simple. And I might actually, if you guys want me to actually upload this shirt, I will, but boom. So now I get the box letter and you can upload it to whatever, you know, design that you wanna use. Um, I personally use Printful, so I can just upload this image to Printful on a black shirt, boom, I'm done, red shirt, whatever, good, right? And then the cool thing is if, see, and then I actually show you a preview which is cool too. Um, so yeah, and then again, they have so many designs that you can kind of, you know, custom, you can custom make. So it's a lot, it's a lot, it's a lot that you can do with this, you guys. So that is it for the tutorial. If you guys have any questions or concerns, let me know. Uh, but it's super simple, you guys. Again, I have a link in the description below uh, for your Canva Pro 30-day free trial. But this is how I create my t-shirts. I literally go through uh, different templates, find the template that I like, and then just go from there. Okay, so if you, guys have, if you guys have any questions, let me know. But that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, be easy.